everyone, it's Mark Strube. Uh, thanks for joining us again here at Strube Residential Group. Um, I'm sitting down with Jessica Bush, and uh, we're doing a fun little thing um, experimentally where, you know, I want to kind of have a conversation that will, you know, show people more about who you are, you know, kind of your personality. Uh, real estate is so personal. It's such a, such a relationship um, that I, I've always felt like it'd be really neat to be able to come through a little bit and, um, yeah, just demonstrate who we are as people more than your written professional bio, you know? Yeah. The, the anti-LinkedIn. Yes. Let's do this, let's do this <laughs> instead. So thanks for sitting down. Sure. It's kind of fun. Yes. Yeah. Um, so, you know, first obvious question out of the gate is just tell us about you. Well, um, so I um, am so lucky that I was able to grow up here in Austin, which yeah. I love. Um, I live here with my twin daughters uh -huh. who are 13. Um, so I love being a mom to them. Sure. Um, they go to Dean's ISD, which is awesome. I live out west of town. Um, I, I think just, that's, let's stop there. Cause like schools, right? Yeah. Eans, you mentioned Dean's ISD. We speak in these jargons and yeah. you know, things like between yeah. ourselves, but that, um, that's, that's amazing. And that's something that you specifically wanted to plant yourself for your daughters. I would Absolutely. imagine um, yeah. the schools are super well regarded and a lot of people moving here to Austin um, are targeting those schools or at least just great public school options for their family. Absolutely. Um, so the fact that you're an Ean's mom and an expert in that um, you know, subject as well is super helpful to people. So I'm, yeah. glad, I'm glad you brought that up. Yeah, absolutely. Um, but yeah, so you know, you've, you've lived around other than in Austin. Yes. You know, so yeah. what sort of brought you back or what keeps you here yeah. in Austin? Um, well, I was, I grew up in um, Austin, like I said, yeah. but um, my career drove me to Dallas. Yeah. And um, so I got into um, marketing through Stuart Title, which was yeah. one of my early uh, jobs right out of college. And that led me into advertising. So Dallas was kind of like a hub for yeah. a lot of the larger agencies, um, you know, in the country and um, so I did a stint up there for as long as I could stand being away from Austin yeah, really yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, and I, I uh, got here as fast as I could but I worked on some cool accounts like General Motors and Subway restaurants and Texas Lottery yeah, and all that fun so. cool stuff yeah. like um, just basically reaching out to consumers and trying to get them to, you know, buy the products that we were advertising exactly. for. So it was a cool stint over in um, that part of my career, I well, guess. Well, for sure. And I feel, I, you know, what's common about a lot of members of our team is like the cool career before career that we bring mm -hmm. forward to real estate. Mm -hmm. and I'm sure there's so many aspects of that that serve you well now as you're, yep. as you're, you know, helping clients with their biggest purchase decision they're ever going to make. Yep. Um, but it's also fun, right? I, I, putting words in your mouth, like now you're dealing with people and their specific lives versus mm -hmm. business to business mm -hmm. sales. Yeah. And um, for me, that's one of the most rewarding parts about being absolutely. in residential real estate. And would you agree? I, absolutely. Yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm totally a people person yeah. anyway. And um, bringing it down from this big macro level to this, you know, micro level yeah. where you're, I don't know if I said that right, but anyway. I think so. Um, you know, one on one individuals like helping them achieve their goals yeah. and and but having that background in advertising where it's like you think about consumers and behaviors and yeah. lifestyle characteristics and that sort of thing really has served me well as i've transitioned into real estate so yeah that's yeah. awesome i love that so yes that's real estate yeah. and then but why is true um i think you said it best when you said the word collaborate yeah. um I, uh, we all spend so much time doing, you know, our jobs yeah. and, um, I don't know that I would even call this a job. It's just like a passion, but, um, you know, we spend a lot of time with one another yeah. and we, we're like the fam. I mean, we call yeah. each other a fam yeah. and I think the things that I love most about being with Stroob is the team and the collaboration and the support and people pushing you up and helping you, yeah. you know, get to that next level. And we celebrate each other's victories. Absolutely. Yeah. And I think, um, you know, that could be an odd thing in real estate where yeah. people are a little more competitive and we're, we have a great competitive spirit, yeah. but it's all a positive pushing people up. And yeah. I think, um, 
if I'm away from my family doing something, you know, that I love, I want to be around people that I, you know, love and want to be around as sure. much as possible. So yeah. I'm very thankful and happy to be right here. Yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> it's so it's so fun, yeah, to just speak with everyone. And I, I certainly feel that way. Just, yeah, the culture, right? I mean, it's a, it can be a really hard profession. And you mentioned it's not... It's not really work or job. It's more like I call it the life. Yeah. Welcome to the yeah. life. You That's know? a perfect word. Yeah. For it, so yeah. if you can't, if yeah, if you don't have that in you, that it's just it's something that is I don't know. It, you yeah. you bring a lot of yourself to it, and so if you don't feel like you're getting a lot yeah. back in yeah. some way, so here it's true. But I feel like yeah, we we're good about helping each other like kind of recharge our batteries. Absolutely. And, um, and you wake up every day and you get to go do something. Like you yeah. get to choose that path. So yeah. why not? choose to be in an environment where people support you and push you yeah. up versus it's, you know the it's, grind. It's, it's, you know. it's rare. So when you find it, hold on to it. I've always said this uh, this this new um, version of truly being a team here at Stroob is, is what's kept me kind of going um, in my now sixteenth year. Because yeah. Uh, yeah, it can be it can be challenging and uh, you have to figure out ways to keep recharging those batteries. So yeah. Um, well put. Is there a quote or a mantra or some sort of, uh, you know, words to live by. We're big on that around here, as yeah. you mentioned with our communications and things, we're often yeah. uh, coming up with little um, sayings. <clears throat> I think if, if I had to sum up the thing that I think of most of is just, um, I am thankful. Like I, you know, could be arguing with my children and I'm just like, I'm thankful, I'm thankful. <laughs> you know, I mean, yeah. it just, just being grateful for, for every little thing, yeah. it, just holding the door for somebody or whatever, just li the little simple things in life like really can fill you up. And I just, I think I am grateful. Like I repeat that in my head all the time, whether it's, you know, a tense situation or if it's a happy situation. Cool. It's just like, I'm, I'm grateful that my legs can carry me around the lake. Like I'm grateful that, you know, I have this team. I'm grateful that, you know, I'm just grateful for so many things in my life. I think if, that would sum it up. Yeah, really. It's, it's powerful. I think that's um, like what you're saying is it's kind of a mantra that gets you through a challenging time as much as you celebrate a good time. Yeah, absolutely. So it's just a powerful uh, yeah. just, way to I live. I am thankful. Yeah. I am thankful. I am thankful. Awesome. And that's <laughs> it's, and, you know, that's that sums up a lot of uh, what I like to say we do around here is just while we celebrate each other and our yeah. victories, it helps to you know recharge those batteries for those times that are more challenging. Yes. Right. So um, the spirit of gratitude that we have here. Um, I think is a big part of our culture and our, yeah. our success, and so um, it's neat to hear you say it yeah. that way in your well, own I think personal that's life. What, what got you here? What made yeah. me feel so sure that this was where I needed to be. Well, so. we're glad you're here. Yeah, yeah it's great Thank to be um, in, in the life with you. So yeah, yeah, absolutely. So thanks, Jessica. <laughs> you're welcome. Okay.